everybody welcome back to the channel so my grandpa got himself a new RV and he's gonna kind of give us a walk around and show us exactly what it is and what features it has yeah this is an 85 Bluebird Wonder Lodge built by the Bluebird Motor Coach Company the ones that build all the safety school bus this is built exactly like it However, from 61 to 2006, they made motorhomes out of this. This is the flagship of their motorhome. It has a Perkins diesel generator that you've heard. Four cylinder. It has a Detroit 6 V92 with an Allison 5 speed transmission. All industrial. Just like the school bus. Got 22 5 rubber. She's got full air ride. All hydraulic jacks. Landing lights, front and rear. That's when you come into an RV spot and you want to park. You can see what you're doing. We have all kinds of storage. Now keep in mind this coach is all steel. There's no wood in this wall. Lots of storage all the way through. Excuse my mess. We have plenty of storage here. Kind of a uh, utility... Uh, Storage for all the uh, jacks, cords. This is a tag axle. Got dual tires on the front, singles on the back. Here is your electrical hookup. It's got a 50 amp service and two 30 amp services. So you can plug into a 110 outlet or you can go to the big 50 amp park outlets. Okay. As we walk around the back, we have rear backup lights here, and we have rear landing lights that'll shine out for a considerable distance. Okay, to access this motor, very accessible. <clears throat> Here's all your coach batteries. Of course, all your check systems here and, and maintenance, uh, easy maintenance access. This is 337 horsepower, built by Detroit. Watch your head here. you notice, I didn't show you on the other side, but all the awnings are canned awnings. They're zip D, meaning they roll up into a metal can, so they don't sun rot like you've seen other RVs do. Again, we have storage. There's three furnaces in the coach, three, ele uh, three electric furnaces, and three roof air conditioners and three propane fired furnaces. More storage. Again, excuse all my junk. This is your fill for the... That one's stiff. This is the propane fill. She's uh, 72 gallons. Is the other access to the outside to the other side excuse me now we'll go to the back here You crawl up on the top. I'll try the phone down. We get a good look at what they put over their original steel roof. Is a quarter-inch diamond plate, full length, full width. For additional, it does two things. It creates an air pocket for cooling in the summertime. It also gives you strength for being up on top. Now we're going to go to the inside. Sorry, but the step does not work. We're waiting on a part. Sorry for them. I mean, sorry for me. <laughs> okay. 
actually when we talk about maintenance this is a, again a blueberry a bluebird a school bus basically parts are readily available not cheap but readily available if you look up in here we're in a time capsule <clears throat> that's what my wife calls it it's uh, I'm the cur curator of a rolling museum we have all analog generators uh, Everything's done with rocker panel switches and analog. I'll have Doc come up here and take a look at that dash, this Starship Enterprise there. Six-way power seat. We do have down on the floor, we have hydraulic leveling jacks. Not sure what the tonnage is, but they're brutes. This thing weighs over 42,000 pounds loaded. All your overhead cabinets are industrial quality, for a lack of a better term. They're built like an airplane. And in, built just like an airplane. It's not what we call scratch built as we call scratch built motor homes. This is a, a fuselage so to speak already built then they put everything inside of it. <clears throat> Which in turns make it a little easier to work with. We've got speakers throughout the house in the rear room and the front area. We have another control panel here. This control panel operates most of your refrigerator microwave all the electrical components inside this coach 110 and 12 volt this coach has a microwave oven there that's been added uh, that's a newer microwave and uh right here if you want to bake your turkey there is a magic chef gas oven along with a stove top here i'm not going to show, show you that because the wife says I need to clean it before I do anything. Okay, we come on back. And I'll let you step back here while I get on that side. And we'll show you the bathroom. Okay. Which needs picked up and clean, but the shower, it looks stinky, but the shower has got ample room because it drops down. And we even have a little settee down there. Pretty cool. Oh, by the way, Dad gets in trouble, Mom's <laughs> reachable. We have a TV, TV controls down underneath. We have another phone. By the way, there was a phone up by the captain's chair in the driver's seat phone here another air conditioning control system we have uh, all the closets can you reach that one there and just open it and do your thing oh no the little lever on the bottom oh, the... Yeah. I haven't figured out what all the switches are for uh, the books look like uh, you know, Webster Dictionaries, Volume 1 through 10. <laughs> All gliders, metal. And what year is this again? This is a 1985 museum. <laughs> it's a true time capsule. Thank you for looking at my Okay, we're going to do now first start of the Detroit 692, 6 V92. It's a V6 diesel. And we have this thing to go.
cold out, like I said, about 30 degrees out today. Man, it's a lot of smoke. Then that generator runs so I can keep the batteries up and charge stuff.